It is the American dream. You buy a new house and as you settle in, it becomes a home. That's right, but unfortunately, a long list of complaints is keeping a group of local homeowners from getting comfortable. And this morning, 13 consumer advocate Trisha Keene looks at the little hassles adding up to big headaches for some Henderson residents. These homeowners can't help but laugh at a situation they call ridiculous. Yep, we've all heard it. All heard that story. Same old, same old. That same old, same old is getting old for Henderson residents who are sick and tired of the seemingly endless repairs they need in brand new homes. They live in the new Bolano community by Pulte Homes, and each of them has a long list of repairs. The finish work is is very subpar. Uh, it, it's the, the texture, the paint, the overspray of paint, paint drippings, uh, baseboards coming off. Kevin and Tammy we're Lush were supposed to close times. on their home last May, paint but say here. they've had issues Literally from the beginning. We delayed closing for two months because they were so behind schedule and there were so many things unfinished. Seven months after finally closing, they still have a lengthy punch list. They're really worried about this exposed wood on the roof just over their front door. I've had to, to fight uh, hand over fist to, to get somebody to, to come out. Denise Winner has quite a list too. I bought a brand new home and it does not feel like it. You come to my house, you'll see a lot of blue tape everywhere. She's not kidding. Walking into her home, you almost feel like you're seeing spots. Workers have marked dozens and dozens of areas that need attention, like these door frames that appear to be installed incorrectly. A blue tape became a big joke around here. Tom Monaco says he's still dealing with repairs six months after moving into his home. He's frustrated with issues like this crack found in his kitchen countertop. Why, why should we have to put up with marks on counters or scratches on floors or, or poorly painted doors or what have you? I mean. That, that's, that, there's no excuse for that. Then there's Kelly Reese. She paid for an upgraded commercial grade refrigerator, but workers realized it wouldn't fit after installing her kitchen cabinets. Colleen Zato paid for an upgraded shower, but it looks like workers used two different colors of grout. It's just, it's sad that it's put such a damper on so what should be such a positive experience and such a happy experience. Um, I just, I feel like they don't care. Then there's Tom Harris. He moved in back in September. Tom says he's already seeing aging signs he didn't expect to see for years. I've got stress cracks in my ceiling already, like the foundation settling. And uh, so that, that's a, a big concern to me. And uh, it's in two spots in my house. 13 Action News reached out to Pulte on behalf of oh, all of these homeowners, that. plus others. Yeah, yeah. Pulte declined to speak on camera, but says it has set up a schedule for repairs on one of the homes. Pulte issued a statement saying in part, we stand behind our homes with one of the industry's best warranties and by providing excellent after sale service. We have and continue to provide warranty repairs on requests submitted by all Pulte homeowners to our customer care center. Bill Lawton is a former quality control and safety engineer with NASA. For the last 25 years, he's been in the home inspection business. There are a lot of problems uh, that the builders have to contend with, labor shortages, uh, uh, training. He says there's also a lack of oversight in many cases, whether it's involving workmanship or materials being used. It's always going to be up to the consumer in this, it appears, uh, to make sure that they, they take you know, that they guard their own rights and, and understand fully what they're getting into. Bill recommends potential home buyers hire their own home inspector and a realtor to help protect themselves, even with brand new homes. As for our group of homeowners, they'll continue to reach out and request the necessary repairs. We just want our homes to be finished and complete. It doesn't matter if, if it's a $10 million home or a, or a $50,000 home, it just needs to be right. For Contact 13, I'm Trisha Keene, your consumer advocate. Well, we have the entire statement from Pulte Homes regarding this story on our website. Just go to ktnb.com if you'd like to read it.